How's it going? It's Steve and Durley here at Tap Room 307, and today we're going to learn how to make the grilled chicken sandwich. So the grilled chicken starts out with a nice beer marinade, which consists of olive oil, lemon juice, the best part, the beer, and a little bit of salt. Next thing I do is I take the chicken and I fillet it, and I trim all the fat off. Then I put the chicken in the marinade. So after the chicken is marinated for at least 24 hours, then we throw it on the grill. Once our chicken is nicely grilled, then I take the chicken and a couple of pieces of bacon and cut it all up. So as you can see, the chicken is really nice and juicy. So we want to cook it to perfection. You don't want to overcook it because it's going to get hot in the oven. Okay, so we're almost ready for the sandwich to go in the oven. We just need to assemble it. We put the chicken inside of the sandwich, followed by the bacon, and after that, a top of the Swiss cheese. And now it goes right in the oven. While the sandwich is cooking behind me in the oven, I want to tell you what makes our sandwich so unique is that the bread is cooked to order. So when you order the sandwich at Tap Room, we assemble it, we put it in the oven, and bake it off, and it comes out nice and hot and fresh. It looks like the sandwich is ready to come out of the oven. So the next thing I do is I just trim it down a little. You can see all the ingredients are nice and hot. Ready to go. Now we're gonna put the cold ingredients inside of the sandwich, starting with the tomato. So the next thing we put is some fresh avocado. Then we add a little bit of our house-made chipotle mayonnaise to give it a little spice kick. And last but not least, a little bit of lettuce and it's ready to eat. So here at Tap Room on the menu, the chicken sandwich comes with fries, salad, or the crowd pleaser, tater tots. So that's how you make the Tap Room Grilled Chicken Sandwich. Thanks for cooking with me. This one's for me. So good.